my name is Nada Chandler. I'm 12 years old and I'm a part of the Brown and Rising Stars. And my public speaking is about skateboarding. Skateboarding have many different parts. The main three are deck, trucks, and wheels. The deck is what you put your feet on when you run. The trucks are what keep your wheels on the skateboard. Your truck can be loosened and tidying depending on how much you want to turn. The looser it is, the easier it is to turn. The tighter it is, the harder it is to turn. And then the wheels, of course, are what make you roll. The first skateboard that they've come up with is in the night was made in the 1940s by a man named Bill Richard. He brought his idea to a skate company and said, we should make the skateboard. They approved of the skateboard and now we see skateboards everywhere. So the basics of how to ride a skateboard are you put your dominant foot on the front. Whenever you're ready to move, you push your non-dominant foot backwards, like you just push yourself off. And then you put the foot that you pushed off with on the back. When you're riding, you should be kind of tilted to the side a little bit, just so it's easier to balance. And turning is what gets a little complicated. When you turn, you have to shift your weight. Um, the two ways to do that is you lean your foot left or right, wherever you need to go, and then the harder you lean, the more you go, the more you go that way. And then the other way is you, when you're doing it, you put your back foot at the very end and your front foot down a bit, then you put your weight on your back foot and balance, your front two wheels should be off the ground. And then you would shift your weight to left or right. And then whenever you finish, you would go back. Um, there are, there are many different types of skateboards. There are um, regular penny board ripstick, long board, and penny board. Okay, so the penny board is a smaller version of a skateboard. This is usually for cruising just because it's very hard to perform tricks because of the smallness of the skateboard. The regular board is used for bikes. It's a meet in the middle. So you, it's easy to cruise, easier than a penny board, and then it performs tricks better than the penny board. And then there's a ripstick. A ripstick is a skateboard with two rollerblade wheels on the bottom. This is a skateboard typically used for pivoting and um, speed. The longboard is very difficult to, to perform tricks, so it's mostly used for going downhill. Because the tricks are so hard to perform because of the weight of the board. So one of the most important parts of skateboarding is your safety. So your safety, you need to wear long pants, knee pads, and elbow pads, because, and a helmet, because scraped knees and elbows are really bad, and if you fall on your head hard enough, you could get, you can go unconscious, and that's not good. So, and then the tricks are ollies. Ollies are where you're able to get all four wheels off the ground. It's kind of cool in my point of view. And then 
Another one is walking the dog. This is like the funniest trick. It's basically where when you're turning, when you put your weight on the back foot, you quickly go to the other foot and then you just keep moving. And it's like you're walking. So, and then the most common one you see is pivoting. Pivoting can be measured on how far you turn. Like a 90 degree would be a quarter and a 360 would be a full circle. How you do this is when you're turning and putting your weight on the back, you just kind of move it around. You have to shift your weight all around. And your goal is to basically do as much as you can. Do as much as you can. And so this is, this is many different things about skateboarding.